So according to USA Today, Pepsi Cola has launched a new lemon lime soda to compete with Sprite in the market. The article states, goodbye Sierra Mist, hello to Starry, Pepsi's new lemon lime soda to take on Sprite. Sierra Mist is being sidelined again. Pepsi's new contender in the lemon lime soda wars is Starry. This is just the latest move by the beverage company to compete with Sprite Coca-Cola lemon lime soft drink, which has captured 7% share of the $82 billion soda market. Sierra Mist only held about 0.1%. Starry's launch marks the most aggressive move made by the company's reinvigorated beverage businesses in years. If you remember, Sierra Mist was replaced in the past, too, in 2016 with a drink called Mist Twist. Two years later, that product was discontinued and replaced with Sierra Mist. The new caffeine-free lemon-lime flavor soda is on shelves now in regular and zero sugar versions. Starry is the great tasting soda bursting with lemon-lime flavor that delivers the crisp, refreshing bite consumers have been longing for. With one product dominating the category, consumers deserve another option. One that hits different, Starry is bright, optimistic, and rooted in culture and fun. Since Sierra Mist only accounted for about 0.2% of Pepsi's total revenue, it probably makes sense to discontinue the brand and then maybe try something else that's new to the market, which consumers tend to like. Some soda samplers chimed in on Twitter about the product. Not everyone was on board with the new drink. One tweeted a video of pouring the soda into a trash can, but a fan tweeted, Starry is better than I expected. So what do we know here? We know that the reason that uh, Pepsi launched this new product is because Sierra Mist brand was not doing anything. They didn't get any piece of the market share at all, and they could not compete with Sprite. So Pepsi said, OK, we're not going to keep pumping money into this brand. Pull the plug on it. Let's try something new. But also. One of the reasons why Pepsi uh, did this is because check out my video that I did about Pepsi cutting hundreds of corporate jobs. And in that article, I stated that one of the reasons why Pepsi was doing that, not only because of inflation, but because of people making healthier choices. Now, you still have some people that still love their sugary drinks and their sugary pops. But then you also have a big percentage of people that saying, hey, I'm cutting out sugar. I'm cutting out alcohol. I'm going to lean towards a more healthier lifestyle. Now, one thing I can say what Pepsi is doing with this drink is that they do have it in a zero sugar flavor. So they are definitely hitting that market of the healthier groups of people to say, hey, you know what? We understand that you want to uh, live a healthy lifestyle. And we support that. So we do have this zero sugar flavor over here. Now, the thing about it, when you take sugar out of products, the taste isn't the same. But for somebody who's um, living a healthy lifestyle, they can get used to the taste. But then for somebody who not living a healthy lifestyle, they still want to taste that sugar. So. It's going to be interesting to see how this product uh, develops and what type of position is going to hold in the marketplace, especially going up against Sprite. Now, according to the article, also, they said that, you know, somebody tried it, they pulled it in the garbage, somebody said they liked it. But that's what's going to happen because you're introducing a new product and the product just came out. So I'm pretty sure that Pepsi is going to uh, definitely do a push campaign to put it out there to uh, get people to go buy it to uh, see what the results is going to be. So they're definitely going to put a campaign into this. Now, how much money or how much uh, effort they're going to put into this, we don't know. But we just have to see what the results is going to be. Now, me being a uh, 
soda person. I'm not a big, big soda pop person. But I am a foodie. So with that being said, I'm definitely going to try this drink. I'm going to try both versions of it and come back and let you guys know what's my thoughts about it. Is this something that you should try or this is something that you shouldn't even waste your time with? But for some of you all who know about this product already, if you have tried it, let me know and leave your comments down below and tell me what did you think about this product. So, yes, your boy is going to go out here and try the product and come back and let you guys know what my thoughts about it is. So until then, hit that uh, subscribe button, hit the like button and stay tuned.